we gather to organize Pinellas. GOP. GOP Pinellas. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 2013 Lincoln Day Dinner. And why are you a Republican? There is no other party because there's freedom, there's liberty, and the Republican Party stands for all that plus. Ladies and gentlemen, Michael Guju, the chair of the PCREC. Good evening, and welcome to the 2013 Pinellas Republican Party Lincoln Day Dinner. When I first asked someone to do this film, I wanted to do a feel-good piece. In front of you, on the table, you will see a piece of paper, a card. And on that card, you will be asked your name, address, and other contact information. And we need them. You see, this is where the rubber hits the road. Where we actually go from neighbor to neighbor, from person to person, and solicit their votes and let them know about the candidates. This is how we win elections. We have to pass on the good conservative message. And if everyone in this room would just take the minute to do that to their neighbor, to their relatives, to someone that they meet in a store, even if they're in public, talk it up, talk it up. That's what we need. The Republican Party is a big tent. We have all sorts of people in our tent, the young, middle-aged, and those who are all grown up. My name is Daryl Hamill, and I'm the president of the Young Republicans here in Pinellas County. Brand new member? Yes. Why? Well, um, I've volunteered on a lot of Republican things before, such as campaigns and stuff, and um, I think it's important to get more young people involved in the party. What do you do in real life? Um, I'm an MBA student at USF St. Pete, and I also work downtown St. Pete. When I went to undergrad, I went to Florida State University, and they had a huge um, college Republicans group there that I was a part of. Young people should get involved. It's important because America's our future. So. Bring your sons, bring your daughters, your nieces, your nephews, uh, your grandchildren, your friends, anybody you know, get involved. We need your help. I'm also a small business owner here in, in Clearwater, and... and between that and my children, I, I figured I got to get involved because I'm not going to watch the world pass me by without at least having a say in it. You look like a banker, but you, <laughs> you are a multi-generational what? A garbage and recycling collection. <laughs> not even close to, to a banker, but I'm proud of that. That's right. <laughs> and the, the point of it being that everyone from every walk of life has a role to play. That's right, absolutely. Whether It doesn't matter if you're a garbage... Uh, collection owner or you know you work for Publix I mean we're all in this together we're all here as Americans and, and as residents of the state of Florida and Pinellas County and we've got to come together to make a difference only us doing this together can we make this make this work there are a number of ways to get involved of course by becoming a member of the PCREC contributing your best talent to the committee and activities that interest you most but best by joining a Republican club in your neighborhood. The important thing is to get involved in a club. That's exactly right. Because that's like the boot camp for uh, all else that goes on. Well, that's what wins elections. The club members are the people, the precinct committee people, who usually most of them all belong to clubs. But these are the people that do the, um, the boot work. The, 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 uh, I guess that's where boot camp we would call it in the service. Barbara Stevens, thank you. Well, you're welcome. This is a surprise. There are many other people in the room that would be wonderful uh, candidates for public office. We have some great Republicans here. Government has promised all of these things that the government cannot provide. But what the government has done every time is continue to blame freedom for the reason that the government hasn't done it. So that the black population has continued to support government expansion, not realizing that it is exactly what is making us slaves all over again. So many of the members get involved at the top of the ticket, but we need to come on down and, and look at the lower part of the ticket. Look at our city council, look at our school board, look at our judges, look at our state reps, you know, and our state senators. We need to get involved locally, because if we think the Democrats aren't out there organizing, make no mistake. They're there. Organizing for action is in, and they're active, mm -hmm. and we need to be just as active. They're always for the Constitution, and that's the biggest thing that I can think of that's important to me. Let's just take a second to acknowledge someone who worked as an officer for 12 years, Glenn Schultz. Hey, miss me yet? <laughs> I'm between a rock and a hard place right now, so you'll have to excuse me. 
where are the all good puns when you need them? Right. Why don't you open the door? I hope you have a great evening tonight. I'm looking forward to it. We have some great speakers. Enjoy yourself. And after dinner, let's get to work. We're the party of Lincoln. We're the party of liberty. That's the Republican Party. We historically are against big government. So come on, folks, get with the program.